everybody, Captain Steve here, and today we are going to show you how to properly deploy a windless anchor system, as well as showing you a couple features. So on this boat here in particular, we do have a safety clip, and most boats should have that, and that prevents it from accidentally falling in and out. Uh, this uh, anchor windless system also has a feature on it that has a free fall mode. And that usually is just a little bit of a pin here that it's pushed out. And what that does is that pin runs down, catches a block and unwinds the bale. That allows the line just to free spool out. And then as you wind it back up, that, that pin comes back around, catches that same block again, tightens the bale and catches back on the line so you can bring it back up. This one here does actually have a remote and an up and down as well as on the dash, we'll get to in a bit. And we're just gonna hit down. So this particular anchor windlass system does have a Delta anchor on it, as well as chain with backed by 300 feet of road. The general rule of thumb that we use is about five to seven foot of line per one foot of water. 10 feet of water, let's pretend we're in here currently. Very minimum, I should have 50 feet of line out. So typically most vessels will have a windlass operation from the helm as well as from the anchor locker. But for instance here, we do have our windlass operation with our corresponding up and down button right here on the dash. This is Captain Steve here. Uh, thank you for following along, watching how to deploy your anchor windlass system. Follow along for more.